I'm Becky Hendrick. I've taught off and on at UTEP starting in 1985 when we first moved here from Indiana. And then I taught full time in the Department of Art from 2001 until last May when I retired from teaching. Whenever there's a call for entries for public art in El Paso, I've always thought it would be a great idea for someone, not I, to uh, do LCD screens, for example, at um, bus stops or places where people wait, so that constantly they would be bombarded with bilingual phrases and messages. I'm not bilingual. I can speak a little bit of Spanish, but not nearly enough. And I just wish every sign were in both English and Spanish. And so I decided when asked to do the pickaxe that this was the perfect size, the perfect um, degree of seriousness to do a bilingual pickaxe. So it says, wow, a bilingual, bilingual pickaxe. Ijole una, un hacha bilingue. It's fun. My husband is Willie Ray Parrish, the former sculptor, sculpture professor at UTEP. He also retired at the end of May. And we were asked to do it together. And as we batted ideas back and forth, we came up uh, with this idea, which I've had for years. Every time a public art piece comes up, I say, somebody ought to do this. So I decided to do it. And as we worked along, it was my idea. I was doing the labor. I fired him. It was an honor, it is an honor to be part of this. We love UTEP so much. We've spent almost 30 years in the El Paso region and it's, it's, it is our true home. Prior to living here, we had never lived anywhere more than three years. We've lived here 30 years. So being part of the celebration is a real honor and being asked to do the pickaxe was a perfect way to end my teaching career here.